Hi, I'm Kay Craigie, N3KN, President of the ARRL. And I'd like to ask for a few minutes of your time today to get you to help thousands of radio amateurs around the country get the chance to put up antennas at their home locations. These are hams who live in communities that have deed restrictions, covenants, homeowner association rules, whatever you call them, these private land use regulations make it just about impossible to have an amateur radio antenna. If you live in one of those restricted communities, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Now, almost 30 years ago, the FCC issued its PRB1 decision. PRB1 requires reasonable accommodation for amateur radio antennas in areas where land use is regulated by municipal zoning. PRB1 has been a great thing for amateur radio, but it does not apply in any way whatsoever to private land use regulations. Now, the number of communities in the United States that have those restrictions is multiplying at a truly alarming rate all over the country. And we have to do something about that because make no mistake, this is a serious threat to amateur radio in the 21st century all over the United States. This is why the ARRL has arranged for introduction of H.R. 4969 in the United States House of Representatives. This legislation would instruct the FCC to extend the PRB1 reasonable accommodation principle to municipalities, to developments where private land use restrictions are a problem. It would create a level playing field for everybody. We have to do this for amateur radio. And time is running short in this session of Congress, so I'd like to ask you today to go to the ARRL website and find out more about this legislation. The website will explain to you what's involved in sending an email making a phone call, writing a letter, urging your member of Congress to become a co-sponsor of this vital legislation. That's what we need right now. We need co-sponsors. We need a lot of them, and we need them now. Look, even if you don't live in a development that has deed restrictions, please do this for your fellow amateurs. Do it for those kids who came with the scout troop out to field day and got all excited about amateur radio. Do it for Americans who haven't even been born yet so that someday they can have the amazing experience of being amateur radio operators and being on the ham bands from their home. Okay, ARRL members, this is a call to action. We need to do this for amateur radio. We need to do it now. Please, today, go to the ARRL website and start doing your part. Thanks, and 73.